Welcome back to, say this is phase two of day two of the Battle of Richmond. We are commencing the attack from the east. Last time we um, pretty handily took out the north fort. There was about 5,000 Confederates that we wiped out, so based on the paper numbers, that was a full quarter of their force. Uh, it was it was four to one. I felt you know I felt something like uh, like I was like um, was, uh, something Compass is doing a, a Union campaign as well, where he's focused on building the biggest Union army as possible. And now in the late stages of this campaign, he's just got this huge Union army that just rolls over a tiny Confederate army, and it just felt like that. It was basically no challenge um, because they just didn't have the manpower to even man all of the positions. So we were able to walk through the woods here entirely uncontested and fl outflank the rest of their uh, positions, and it was trivial. And so here we are. The, uh, this is two more corps. The majority of our brigades can now attack the east side of the town. Do not hesitate. Bring your men forward. Our main target are the forts. Concentrate all your firepower near the forts. This one and this powerful star fort. Proceed with caution. Pause. Okay. They have now... <laughs> wow. Alright. They've got another 5,000 men on the field. You pull back. Uh... So we're going to start swinging down with these guys. Um, go over here. These guys need to now move up to this position. We'll put, um, you need the most rest, so you can go over here. You kind of need rest as well, but you don't get rest. Sorry. Keep the skirmishers moving down. Route these guys off the field after we captured them. And now our favorite part of the battle. Core management. <sighs> okay. It's going to take a little bit. I'll try to do this as quickly as possible. Combine. Combine. Combine, 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 at least they put my divisions right next to each other, makes things a little bit easier. Combine, combine, right, right, okay. So I think this actually was the standalone unit that got shoved down all the way to the south, um, but didn't get its uh, elite brigade paired with it, so it was just kind of hanging out on its own. And up there, these guys have gave them their assignments already. Yeah. Okay, so if we're really doing this right, we know we already claimed these, and these guys were running away. So I am reasonably certain there should be basically nothing in here. Um, there might be something here, but I kind of doubt it. Um, this is from the previous map. We know we. Um, the first day's map extended out to about here. At any rate, what I'm getting at is it's basically safe if I just do this. Oh god, draw it better.
There needs to be a better way to do this. Use the roads, they are important. Apparently I can't draw straight lines. Please don't judge me. I'm just going to watch the angles that we're going to be taking here. These guys can go straight in. Um, I'm not super concerned here. I need this force to actually continue swinging around to then hit this force all the way around from the north side. Um, we're going to take these guys out and then these guys are just going to go, they're going to go straight ahead and basically just get into position here. Um, you know what? I'm I am not a hundred percent certain that uh, they don't have any forces there. So I'm gonna go ahead and scout with them first just to be safe no harm in it Get these guys moving out. Something like this, I think. All right, and unfortunately, we are now going to be start experiencing a little bit of a slowdown since we've got three core on screen. Where are you going? Ah, oh, jeez, why are you all the way over there? It's <laughs> a bit of an oops. Draw down with them. Draw down with them. Ah, uh, I am missing. I'm missing a brigade from my fourth division. And I'm missing a brigade for my first division also, if I look at this right. That's a very strange mission. Well, it is what it is. Hopefully these guys can pull their weight.
Okay, I don't see any guys here, so we're just going to go ahead and go straight forward. for now. It's going to take a bit to do this crossing still. Sniper skirmishers, gotta love them. Can't live without them, can't live with them, can't live without them. That's a howitzer. It's a howitzer as well. And this is probably a howitzer? No, this is a parrot. Okay. Gonna keep pushing these guys down. <sighs> this kind of thing just really annoys me all the time. Unfortunately, it's going to take some time while we manage all of our troops here.
seem to have missed a gun. That is pretty typical. So we're going to swing in an angle against these guys. Hi there. We're coming out to here. These guys are starting to take some artillery fire. Bring the officer up. down here just as a screen. As again, we keep um, just managing our troops. Swing the artillery down and around. Swing these guys over and through. They're taking some light shelling, which is not amazing, but... And keep pushing these guys up.
think that because this is a star fort, I think I have time to just sort of walk up together like this. Or rather, that's the only thing that I can do. You're just going to sit back here. Keep rotating south. Pushing south. On the interior lines now. Okay, you're fine. So he's had enough. Just gonna put really only two can fit there. That's interesting. Um, let's just grab you and I think you. And again, we're just gonna cut a couple of our howitzers here in reserve and keep shifting everything down I lost a gun here that really annoys me You guys can just kind of hang out here.
to slide this way and just get the full weight of the Union Army to come down here. So we need to put some guys in here. Um, and again, some artillery. Just going to keep pushing these down. Make sure that these guys don't fall behind any more than they already are. And I need to pick... Uh, These guys moving over here, and I need to pick some more garrison forces. These guys are probably going to do just fine. So I'm going to preemptively start getting some guys rotated out this way. And there we go. That will do for this phase. Thanks for watching.